Hi, what I want to do today is show you how to program a basic 800 megahertz trunking system, a type 2 Motorola trunking system on a 996T Uniden scanner. First thing we do is select menu, which brings us up our general programming menu, and we select program system. When we're in the program system menu, we select new system, and then from the new system menu, we select Motorola Type 2. And we confirm that we want that new system. When you're in the new system menu, and it'll take you there automatically, you can edit the name, you can do a whole bunch of things here. Um, what we're going to do is create a new site within our new system. So we scroll down to Edit Site, and then we have the option of selecting a new site, and we select that. From there, we select our 800 megahertz standard, which will take us into a new menu for our new site. So we'll do a couple of things now. First is we'll set the startup key for our new site, and in this case, since it's the first one, we'll just select one. What we'll do is we'll set the control channel frequencies only for our new site, and I won't put them in here, but you get the idea. So we input our new frequencies. We hit enter. Here it's going to tell me that I've got no frequencies in there essentially, which is fine. After we've inputted our control channel frequencies, however many they are, one, two, or three, or four, we keep scrolling down the menu in a new site as such, and we make sure that control channel only is selected. So we click on the set control channel only, we make sure it's on, which it is, which for our Motorola system means that we can do all the trunking we like, but just off the control channels only, which is excellent. So what you've done now, in effect, is set up a new site within a new system for 800 megahertz Motorola Type 2 trunking. The only other thing that uh, I would suggest that is worthwhile doing is to set the quick key as such. And again, you can select from 1 to 99. So this is, in effect, uh, the system key. So in this case here, we'll select something like, um, let's select number 99 and we're done. So what that means now is when I go back out of all these menus and we just backtrack, we can either hit scan or we can just backtrack through the system menus by hitting system. If I want to have a look at my new site, I hit the decimal point and then type in 99 and ordinarily it would take me to my new system but uh, there's nothing into the scan at the moment because I didn't put any control channel frequencies in there. But that's essentially how you do it. Pretty easy.